Chennai, New Delhi November 30th, the probe by the Enforcement Directorate, ED, is against a scrap customer and not against Ashok Leyland, said a top company official. The Enforcement Directorate, ED, on Wednesday said that it has attached properties worth 22.10 crore rupees of firms in a prevention of money laundering case relating to the BSIV vehicle scam, and the role of Ashok Leyland was also being probed. The properties are in the names of firms connected to Dawakar Road Lines and Jatadhara Industries Private Limited of former Andhra Pradesh TDP MLA JC Prabhakar Reddy, and another firm C. Gopal Reddy and AMP, core and family members. The Supreme Court had in 2017 ordered that vehicles that were not compliant to BSIV emission norms should not be sold in India by any manufacturer or dealer from April 1, 2017, and that the registering authorities were also prohibited. However, Jatadhara Industries Private Limited, JIPL, and C. Gopal Reddy & Co. in contravention to the aforesaid order purchased BS3 vehicles from Ashok Leyland Limited at discount and fraudulently registered the same as BSIV vehicles by fabricating the invoice copies. Investigation revealed that some of the registrations were done in Nagaland, Karnataka and Andhra Pradesh. Responding to a list of questions sent to Ashok Leyland's executive chairman Dheeraj G. Hinduja by Ians, the company said, this matter reported seems to be pertaining to an old investigation from the year 2020-2021. The investigation is not against Ashok Leyland, but against a third-party scrap customer. We have submitted all documents and details as required by the Enforcement Directorate pertaining to this matter, which clearly establishes that we are not implicated in any manner. Ashok Leyland is compliant with all emission requirements, the company added. The ED has gathered evidence in the form of fabricated invoices from RTO authorities in Nagaland and original invoices issued by Ashok Leyland as scrap for some vehicles and established the crime. The crime proceeds generated by owning and selling these vehicles have been quantified as 38.36 crore rupees, the ED said. As a result of the investigation and searches, movable properties to the extent of 6.31 crore rupees consisting of bank balances, cash, jewellery and receivables as well as 68 number of immovable properties to the extent of 15.79 crore rupees belonging to accused and their family members have been attached. Further investigation was in progress, including the role of Ashok Leyland in the entire scam. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.